So we're talking about ghosting, and in this bracketed set of three images here, there's a couple cars, and I'll open an example for you. Let me resize this so you can see a little bit better. So you can see these two cars here, this one specifically, and this car here. They're both in motion, so when we took the bracketed set of images, what we end up with is the car in a different place in all three images, which leads to what we call ghosting for obvious reasons. It kind of looks like a ghost. So the way we deal with that, um, there's several ways to deal with it, but my, my preferred method of dealing with that is via Photomatix Pro, which just happens to be my favorite uh, HDR software. So we just select our three bracketed images, and I'm gonna drag them right on top of the icon and let go. And when we get to this screen, there's a bunch of options. This is the pre-processing option screen. And what I'm going to select in this case is remove ghosts. Now, Photomatix gives us two different options. We can do this uh, with selective deghosting, which is what they recommend. It's kind of like a semi-manual or semi-automatic mode. Um, and the next method is automatic, which is self-explanatory. So for demonstration purposes, I'm going to go ahead and select automatic. I would normally reduce the noise. I would check this. I would also uh, check this to reduce chromatic aberrations. But for the sake of time, I'm just going to move forward with the ghosting. And you can see what it's doing now is it's trying to figure out where it thinks that that car or those cars should be in this case um, and remove the ghosting effect that we see. Um, so it's almost set and we have our image. And it looks like Photomatix did a pretty good job. I'm going to move this around and make this a little bit bigger so we can see. And you can see here, it looks like the ghosting has been completely removed. We look at our loop and it looks pretty good. Uh, I don't see any ghosting in this instance. We've got a text where there was before. And I'm going to look at this other image here, or this other car, I should say. And the ghosting has been completely removed from that car as well. So using the automatic method of Photomatix, it did a pretty good job. And that's it for this video.